Sit. Sit. Okay. You want me to be the nice old grandpa or you want me to be the grand exalted poobah of baseball apadesh? Okay. I'll be the nice grandpa to start. Hey, oh boy. These games are classic old-time baseball pitching matchups. Two two-to-one games. Wow. This is like Palmer, Seaver, or Gibson, Koufax, or Drysdale, Ford. I mean, this is beautiful baseball being played. Bravo. Bellissimo. Now I'm going to tell it to you straight. Listen. I'm fucking tired of setting fucking strikeout records for the postseason, okay? It's past a curiosity now. It's a fucking bad thing. We strike out as a team at an alarming rate, okay? Every single player last night, except D.D., struck out at least once, okay? When you get five hits, you cannot do this. You jerk offs, you can't argue, oh, it's the feast or famine thing with the home run hitting club. Bullshit! You want to hit five home runs last night? Fine, then I'll accept the 13 strikeouts. But if you aren't going to hit home runs, then stop the fucking striking out. I'm serious. Strikeouts are technically the worst thing that can happen at the plate, okay? If you put the ball in play, anything can happen. Runners advance, errors happen, balls find holes, whatever. But strikeouts, it's like you vanished into thin air. You're just an out, and you didn't even contribute to anything. We have to stop striking out now! Okay. I'm going to have to say it. Sanchez, sorry, buddy, but you have to make that play, okay? There's a difference between a thrilling play at the plate to end the game where the throw beats the runner or the runner beats the throw, but last night the throw beat the runner easily. You have to catch it and make the tag. You just do, Gary, okay? It wasn't a difficult hop. You're a catcher, Sanchez. Catch the fucking ball! My mother-in-law lost again last night, okay? That's two in a row, gentlemen, okay? She's taking the day off along with you fucking morons, okay? So she isn't even going to mybookie.ag. She isn't going to put in the promo code VIC. She isn't going to win money today, okay? See what I did there? Now, look. Thank God Sevy is okay, okay? That's important, okay? Joe. You did a good job with the pitching, and again, I mean it. I mean, come on. We went eight innings and gave up a combined three hits and one run. I mean, Jesus Christ, that's amazing. Then we bring in the closer, and he shits the bed. What do you do? You change the sheets, you spray a little Lysol in the air, and you move on. Maybe you have to buy a new mattress if the shit in the bed was really bad. I've shit in the bed many times. I never had to buy a new mattress, so I, I think we're okay. Rothschild, you keep those fucking pitches throwing just like this. You just keep doing whatever you're doing, okay? And wh wh where is Cockrell? Where is Cockrell, there you are, hiding behind Tori S. Listen, Alan Cockrell, the hitting coach, the hitting coach. What the fuck kind of last name is that? Cockrell? Who has cock in their last name? Well, I'll tell you right now, you are going to have a cock in your eye, neck, ear, throat, and ass if you don't teach these assholes to stop striking out, okay? We're setting records, Coach Cockhole. Bad records. The fuck are you teaching them? Get the offense back together now, damn it! Okay, look. I'm not going to talk about Verlander, okay? That man pitched fucking great for nine innings. Fastball up 96 mile per hour. A complete game. The last time I saw a complete game, I think fucking uh, Reagan was president. 
A complete game, Joe! You see that, Joe? A complete game! I bet your binder was fucking sweating! How about Altuve? That little fucking cock-sucking midget. All he does is hustle and work hard on every fucking play on offense and defense. I take my, my hat off to that little fucking turd, okay? You should all play like him. Joe, I beg you to move Judge out of that two hole. And you're a very stubborn guy. You're like the definition of insanity. You keep doing the same thing every fucking night and you expect a different result each time. I'm gonna ask you again, would you? Or would you not consider putting Hicks in the two-hole? He's a switch hitter, so he won't fuck up your, your lefty-righty bullshit thing. And, he'll, and move Judge to four or five. It will protect the hitters in front of him batting three and four. And might bring him up with more men on base so they have to throw more strikes to him. Would you just consider that, Joe? Guys, we're two games back. Two games back to back, we lost two to one. That's great baseball. It really look look, guys. You guys weren't even expected to be here. This is supposed to be a rebuilding year. But you played classic baseball. Learn something from it. If you don't know now, you can beat this team, you can beat their two aces, then now you know. You lost two games, two to one in Houston. And now we go home. Let's go home. I could say we should be up or tied in this series, but we aren't. Forget the past. We play one game. One inning, one pitch at a time. I'll see you guys in the clubhouse tomorrow, okay? Bring your Yankee mindset, boys. I right, get out of here.